this is going to be a really, really, really short vlog, but um, I have had a request to do a, a decorate with me for Christmas. Um, the only little thing, I'm just going to be decorating just a little, just a little area of my house. Um, I'm not going to do anything to stir crazy. I'm not going to put up a Christmas tree or anything. But this is what I, this is something that I did a couple of years ago before I actually moved here. And I really liked it. I mean, I didn't have to, I put a lot of creativity into it and it just seemed like it worked really well. And, you know, I don't want to do anything fancy for Christmas. So this worked out perfect. So, um, I'm going to do a little haul, and then I will show you the before and after of what I did. I'm going to show you this little haul. Not everything is from one specific store, but I do remember most everything that I got from that store. So, I'm going to show you what I got. So, the first thing I got is this little... Tin. I got a lot of boxes this year, um, and it's got Santa and a penguin, it looks like a little elf, um, and a reindeer, it looks really cute, um, and these are going up for decoration, I'm not going to use these, particularly for, like, gifts or something, um, so I got that, I also got this little thing, it kind of looks like a mistletoe, I wish I had, like, a little, um, thing that looks like a mistletoe under here, um, but I don't, so, but it still looks really cute. Um, let's see, I also got these bells. Um, I have an idea, um, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do with them, but I have an idea. Um, I also got these bells, these are red. And I also got this little box present thing. These, these, all these items were a dollar, um, but I got this little thing that says Merry Christmas on it. And then I also got, okay, those items were from the Dollar Tree. Um, they were really cute, and I thought that would look really cute. And then from Dollar General, um, these are all a dollar as well. I got this. It's going to represent the Christmas tree because it's green. Um, I got this little ribbon. I haven't quite sure what I'm going to do with it yet, but it just says snow on it. Um, I got this box. It's got a snowman on it, and I thought it looked really cute. And then I also got this Merry Christmas one. That looks really cute. And then I also got this thing that says Fresh Pick Mistletoe Kisses for Free. Um, since I am engaged now, um, this is not my actual ring, but it looks really cute on me, and I wanted something to like. I don't know, just to get used to the idea of having a ring on my finger. So, um, I got this, and it just says mistletoe. I thought it looked really cute because, you know, we're newly engaged as of three months now. So, I thought this would look really cute, like, in the middle of something or something. So, that's why I got this. And, yeah, that's all I got. Um, on the side, it says mistletoe. I looked at this, and I said, I gotta get it. So, yeah, it looks really cute. So anyways, I am going to do a time-lapse vlog of what I did. So stay tuned. Alright, so this is the before. I'm thinking about putting it right here on this bottom shelf. This is the baker's rack, and this is what it looks like. Um, he likes Legos, so we all have Legos. This is the quarter, all the quarters from different states. Um, we haven't been to all the different states, but, you know, the quarter book thing, whatever. And then we have just a couple little knickknacks and the word love right there. And then we got this London thing, which is mine. I built that in like three days. Um, we got it in Kansas City at the Lego store. And then I just have a bunch of knickknacks up here. And this is what Tyler built. I think he built it in like a day or so. It's just a dragon. And then we have a couple more little knickknacks and then my little owl thing right there. All right, and so this and then the bottom shelf currently i have an owl i have me with a picture of my dog that i used to have which i miss um we have some more legos here um he has a book right there and so those are some of the characters this is some quarters and dollars this is an equal this is my grandma and grandpa this is a picture of my family on my mom's side as of 
2010, I don't remember when, <laughs> to be honest, but that is an old picture, but, you know. And then we have some quarters from different places, like London and London and just around the UK area. We got some Pokemon, because he's into Pokemon. We got a candle, and then we got this London clock that he got me for Valentine's Day? Valentine's Day? And then this is it got drawers, and then it's got a little rack at the bottom. So, this is what it looks like currently. And so, I'm going to show you a time lapse of me rearranging this and making it a Christmas tree. Tyler doesn't even know about this. So, yeah. Stay tuned. It doesn't look perfect, but, you know, hey, it's there. He's going to love it no matter what. That looks interesting. Look at it. Then we got some bells. Where is this going to go? Alright, and then little air. There we go. That's what it needed. It needs some bells. There we go. Alright guys, and this is the finished thing of what I got come up with. I used everything that I got. It cost about, oh, probably 10 bucks or so. But, I've got those little bells. I've got that present. I've got those. And I've got this snowman. To be honest with you, though, that looks a lot better. I was looking at it in my viewfinder and I was like that looks a lot better but yeah um, this is I think what I'm going to do instead of doing an actual Christmas tree because he wants to put up a Christmas tree oh and I also got the ribbon up here too I was I had that bow originally up here if you remember but it just didn't look great so yeah. 
Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please like it and subscribe and comment down below what is one of your favorite family traditions or Christmas traditions or whatever. And I would like to know. And as always, thank you for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Okay, bye guys. Love you.